What's going on guys? So do you feel that? Is that wind coming next to me? I don't know. I, don't, I hear a Because the winds are changing on my channel. We're gonna bring some my team to the channel So let me just show you guys my lineup that I have currently how this series is going to work 2,000 likes if you guys want me to keep doing this That'll be my main like indication you guys want me to make this a series Pretty much if you guys have been watching any of my Madden stuff, it's gonna work pretty much the exact same way I'm going to be playing a game if I win, I get to open a bundle, gonna make my team a lot better, and that's pretty much the way it's gonna work. How, the thing that I need your guys' help with is what do I play? So I was looking at this for a while. Challenges are multiplayer. Um, so we have our War of Challenges. I don't think we wanna do challenges. Supermax, Domination is single player, and Pack and Playoffs is drafting a team. So I believe the only thing we have is Supermax. We're gonna go play Supermax. If you guys look at my team right now, you can see I have Damian Lillard, Larry Hughes, Larry Bird, Porzingis, and Gasol. That is my squad. It's gonna get better because at the end of this, I'm gonna be spending that 59,000 VC, assuming I get the W on making my team better. I love you guys. God bless each and every single one of you. Sorry, I just stumbled on my words. I don't know why I did that. I'm just so excited. I'm really, really looking forward to playing this game and proving that I'm not totally trash at my team. If I get dominated, obviously I'll have to just say I'm trash, but I don't think I am. These games, I believe, if I know correctly, I believe these are five minutes, which is absolutely perfect. Um, it's the exact same length as a my career game. It's just, it's actually fun. The only difference between this and my career is that I can't just go do whatever I want in this, and I can just go do a dribble god, as I just showed that I kind of was, not really. Um, what's the last, I'm trying to think of the last, the last basketball game I played was 2K16 for the video yesterday morning because my shot meter just feels really, really off right now. Uh, how this is gonna work, I'm looking forward to getting a really good team. I know this mode is not popular. I have a gut feeling though, like around Christmas and stuff, it's gonna get more popular and people are actually gonna start playing it again. I think they're gonna realize what they're doing wrong and start releasing some cooler content. There we go, they make a shot too. Okay, so it's gonna be kind of an interesting commentary. I'm just gonna kind of chime in when something good happens, etc. But for this first little bit, I'm just gonna run my offense. So he's going straight up. He, he's on ball. He's an on ball defender who's going to try and make plays. That's good. Beautiful. Nice hit from three. Porzingis. Beautiful. Porzingis is the guy who's going to kind of lead the squadron. Like, he, I, I don't get him for many games is the problem. Like, he's a pretty, like, rare occurrence. But because I haven't played a lot of my team, I, I have, like, the great honor of getting to play with him early in this whole thing. I'll get up there. Come on. Can we, we, need, we gotta get a rebound, man. We can't be getting outboarded like that. Okay, good stuff. Go. Got a good chance to kind of take advantage of this at the beginning of the game. This is a good card, too, as well. This Damian Lillard. And I actually love Bro. Damian Lillard. One of my favorite players in the NBA. Oh, that was an interception, though. Thought I might be able to get that pass over him. Okay, so 9 to 4. And I can already feel that just... Like, you know how, like, in certain times, like, before you ride a bike, you put on the training wheels. Do you guys kind of understand what I mean by that? Before you put, before you ride a bike, you put on the training wheels. So you gotta make sure that you can actually move around decently before you go get in the online scene. I paid my dues with my career, and now I feel like I am going to kind of reap the benefits when I start playing online. Do I think I'm going to be amazing? No, but I think I'm gonna be a lot better than usual in these games nine to six now let's see kind of what we got. i gotta start getting a little bit more of a consistent offense i'd like to go just a straight isolation with damian Laird because i feel like my dribble moves are at the point when i can kind of mess with him a little bit here he played pretty good defense look look at the way he's playing look look at the way he's playing he's just asking for fadeaway swishes like he's just begging he's like please tdb hit a fadeaway swish on me i don't love my memphis really jerseys though if i'm being honest those are like my least favorite part of the team the grizzlies jerseys I, I don't hate Memphis, but I wish I had some Raps colors on. Like some good old-fashioned Toronto Raptors colors. Yo, stay on him, stay on him. Good job. That's Kyrie Irving right there. In case you guys are wondering, I think this dude has a pretty good bench. Okay, get the ball up. That's going to him. Drop back, drop step. Look around. Kemba Walker. Go inside. I want to hit him with a little bit of a spin move. Back. Corner wide open. Hit the three. Green bean. Beautiful. 16 to 6. My man, Skylight. Skylight125 is having a bit of a tough day today. It is not his day. And even if he quits early, guys, like, this series is going to work. Like, that it's just going to go. Like, obviously, if I win, I just need to open up my packs. That, that, that's, like, the main thing. If we win, we, we get to open up some packs. Let's go over there. Corner, Kemba Walker. Corner, can we hit the three on that one? No, we can't. Get the ball back to him, though. What about that one, Kemba? There we go. 19 to 6 now to start off this game. I'd say the training wheels have come off. 
The training wheels have come off. Inside, that's going to go corner three for Skylight. He misses that one. Okay, keep running the floor. Kemba Walker is one of my favorite players in the NBA. And just to watch, watch how the way this guy plays. So he's coming out. He's going straight like user. He's pretty much one dribble move away from being a fade away from... Oh, that's a miss. Not going to lie. You guys are going to see that. I just missed... That's okay. It's okay to admit it. Go, go. Inside. Good, good job. Good job. Easy buckets underneath the rim. That's 23, I believe. If I know, I believe that's Draymond Green. I'm not sure which version of him he is. He might be playing the same position as Larry Bird, which might be why he's not getting a ton of minutes. Let's go. 21 to 6. Just straight domination. I'm not saying this guy's good, okay? Let, let me first get that bluntly across. This dude is not very good. But it's a confidence game. It's the first game ever. I'm going to try and hit it. Beautiful switch. 23 to 9. Good little first quarter. And a good start to the series. Like, you can't blame me. Like, this is a pretty fun start to what I think is going to be a pretty miraculous series that we're going to do on the channel. Voice crack. Okay, top here. We're going to get some dribble moves going. Going to get a little bit fancy inside Draymond Green here again. 27 to 9. He's calling a timeout. I don't know if that's the CPU or him. Somebody's calling a timeout. I would be probably going to bed if I was him. I, I'd go, I'd turn off my PlayStation. I might not ever turn it on. Uh, if I looked in the corner, I saw TD Bear. No one is one of the worst my team YouTubers or players at the game, which I don't think is true. I think I've definitely like got that title away. I played this game for a couple of years now. When I started, I was the worst. By bar none, I was the worst gamer on the planet when I started this. Like I was so incredibly bad. I hadn't played a 2K game in like forever since I was like super young. So I had no idea how to dribble, no idea how to do anything. But now I kind of know some things. Um, Porzingis should be there with a decent opportunity just to run through and get a dunk. Porzingis is just like the most awkward looking dude when he dunks. Like you get that inside animation and he's just like, doesn't jump, he just goes like this. It's like, okay, that's going in. You know who hasn't really touched the ball? Larry Legend. Larry Legend. Get, get me a screen. Easy pull up three for Larry Burton. How am I going to miss? with Larry Bird. One of the greatest three-point shooters of all time. I just missed a wide open shot with him. That's embarrassing. And I, and I gotta hold that for a long time. That, that's a sad statement. Okay, at the top, he's trying to play some heavy close man right now. Porzingis, outside, across, back to Larry Bird. Larry Bird for three. Can we hit it? No, we can't. Porzingis, easy underneath the basket. Gets the foul too. Like, that was anticlimactic. We didn't hit a three, but essentially we're gonna get a three because Porzingis is gonna hit this which is gonna make things really easy for us. Our defense has been locking up. I have this guy's offense to a point where it's not even funny figured out. All I do is I kind of give him, like that's pretty much a steal that I got right there. I give him a little bit of space. He wants to work it inside. I leave everybody inside. I, I don't really mess too much with everything. Let's see, Damian Laird at the top. He hasn't been in the game for a little bit of a long time. Let's see, over, corner, wait for it. And I can't wait till we get a bit of a better team because this is gonna be a blast. When my team improves. Cross court. Carmelo Anthony. Quick release. And no Porzingis. I'm, I need to find a way to buy Porzingis. I don't care what I got to do. I need that card. On like a full time basis. I can't just be part time with him. I need him all the time. Oh nice screen. Nice screen. Beautiful. Down low. Porzingis. Goaltending on who? The guy who shot or who? I, I don't know. I believe we got the point. But it's just weird because there was my Porzingis shot, then the Porzingis was called for goaltending. So I don't really understand. He had one too, which it just looked weird. Yo, Kemba, look around. Kemba went in fast break. I'm not the type of guy who's always like trying to force it. I'm always trying to be as simple as possible. There's a nice little like running with Kemba Walker. Looks like his back got hurt or something. I'm not sure what happened there. Um, just hit the free throws. But when I get a fast break, I never want to have a, like a situation where I'm trying to force it. If I have a point guard and there's a big guy standing right in the net with his hands up, I'm not just gonna. I find a lot of people not calling anybody, but I, I know that there's people who, when that happens, they just go and they run directly into the big guy, and then they nothing good happens, and they're sad, and they're like, "Why did this happen to me? It's not fair." It's like you just ran right into him. What do you think? It's like it's just the laws of the world. If you run right into somebody who's a lot bigger than you, not good things are going to happen. Um, Kemba Walker, step back. Let's see if he's going to guard the three on me. I don't know. The worst thing, the worst decision he's made today was usering. Ready? Oh, 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 got him. Oh, ankles, ankles. Sorry, hit the, oh man, I wanted to that. I have him on a little bit of skates on the defense side of the ball. Okay, hands up on Porzingis. 
Good stuff. That's a foul, but I'm just gonna try and get some sweet dribble moves here. We gotta make someone fall. Like that, that's my goal. Just make someone fall to the ground. Oh man. Oh, I'm sorry for this guy. Larry Bird wide open for three. Hit it, Larry Bird. Beautiful. 40 to 15 now. Um, he is like, let's just show you kind of what happens when he goes on offense. What I do and what I've been doing is this. Letting him have that confidence to go inside. It's, it's kind of a psychological thing. When people see that I'm not there, they, they want to just force it and go outside. Oh, man. Oh, man. Back. So that's charging on me. Actually, that's blocking. Hey, that's cool. You get the benefit of the doubt, Damian Lillard. That's what I'm talking about. I, I thought for sure I was going to get a charging call on that one. I think it probably would have been the better call. Green release. Dale Lillard corner 43 to 15. When does this dude quit? Like what when's I, I don't know man. I feel like I'm tired. I want to go to bed. Like this this dude, I want to open up some packs. This guy's gotta be quitting eventually. Come here. Come here, Kristaps. Come here, Kristaps. Beautiful. Oh man, that's the dynamic duo if I've ever seen one. That is a dynamic duo if I've ever seen one. Crab. Corner. Beautiful pass. Green release. That's what I'm talking about. Got myself in some open space, saw him across, and I know both my point guards can hit whatever pass they want. Okay, so I got bored, I started playing with the player lock feature. <laughs> I, I know, that's like a special kind of bored in a game. When, when you're really winning, that, that's when you know you can just kind of do whatever you want, is when you go to the player lock. Also, I want to start working on my post moves, which don't look very good. Now, four seconds inside Collison go try and hit a fade away beautiful and now everything's going for me that's how you know when you're hitting shots like that you know life is good and things are gonna work out for you it's 66 to 23 I don't think you guys are gonna see me until the pack opening part of the video to be honest unless there's something like drastic that happens I think I'm just gonna see you guys then I'm quite bored at this point uh, I know you guys are and I don't want this video to be 38 minutes long so and like he just keeps fouling these like it's just it's gotten kind of out of hand low key so I'll see you guys in the pack opening part after we win, but I'll I'll probably leave a verification of what exactly happened. Let me just try and take a contested three. It's, that's what it's like. That's what it's like for me right now. Anything that's contested, I'm hitting everything. 69 to 23. See you guys at the end. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to make the pack opening part pretty quick. We have 59,000 VC to spend. I'm going to open up as many packs as I can for 59,000 VC. Okay, so I got no face cam for this part. I figure you guys don't really need to see it. We're just going to be opening up these packs, seeing what happens. Yo, let's go Tim Duncan. Let's go Tim Duncan. Let's flip all of those and see what we're going to get. So we have about 11,000 when it comes to this whole thing. Uh, I'm just going to keep opening the sell strategy card, obviously. Uh, yeah, this part of it, I'm usually not going to have face cam just because I don't really want to. Uh, I, I just like to open packs. I don't know why it's a thing with me. Also, my face cam died. So if you're wondering, if you want the real reason, there it is. I'm going to crack open all the packs at the same time, see who we get and we get in 67. Wow, that sucks. That really makes, like, puts into perspective how good that Tim Duncan was, though. Like, I was pretty, dis I wasn't super, like, ecstatic when I saw the, tongue the Duncan at the beginning. Now, I'm kind of feeling it. We got three more of these packs to go. Hopefully, we can get at least two starters. We got Tim Duncan, who I believe will be a starter or at least a bench. 81, yes, 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 yes. Raptors, Kyle Lauer, he is my guy, man. I'm a sort of huge Toronto Raptors fan, so you know me and Kyle have a pretty good relationship. Um, 25k, so we got two more of these packs remaining. Uh, I know there are some like decently high overall historic players, but pretty much in my team this year, I've, I've heard that for the most part, there's not a lot of amazing players in general. Alfred Payton, uh, that kind of sucks. That's kind of a little bit of a bummer. Sell all contents for 150. 11,000 remaining here. My phone's ringing right at the end of the video, trying to end and wrap up episode one of this my team. I kind of pride myself on the fact that some of my videos are just like, they're not perfect, but they're there. You guys get to watch 83 remote sessions. Okay, so we had two point guards that we're going to add to the team. Uh, the team should get a lot better. I'm probably going to get more VC for the next one. See what we can open. Well, we kind of went all out with these, like, these milestones packs, even though they were kind of trash. What's the box situation? League moments, 10 packs. But I could have got that, I guess. 10 milestones. Yeah, these were like crazy expensive. If you look at these... That one would have been absolutely insane. I probably would have gotten nothing out of it anyways. Thank you guys so much for watching. God bless, and I'll see you guys next time.